for grace. We honor you for your love. We honor you for your kindness. We honor you for your goodness. Let's lift our voice and just begin to thank Him. Lift our voice in praise to Him, in honor to the Lord. Let's appreciate Him. Let's give that honor to Him. The Lord Jehovah God, we honor you. Jesus, we honor you. Jehovah God, we honor you. Mighty God, we honor you. King of kings, we honor you. Lord of lords, we honor you. Jehovah God, you are great. There is no one like you. There is no one beside you. Somebody thank him right now. Let's begin to thank him. Let's begin to honor him. The Lord Jehovah, we thank you for your grace. For us, O oh God, we thank you for your love towards us. We thank you, Lord, for your spirit. Let's begin to thank him. Let's begin to honor him. Let us give that thanks to him. Let's give that glory to him. Let's worship him. Let's exalt him. Let's worship the Lord from our heart. Let's worship the Lord from the bottom of your heart. Let's give that honor to whom is due. Jesus, our King, we thank you. Jesus, our Lord, we worship you. Jesus, our Savior, we thank you. We worship you, O God. Somebody thank him right now. Let the redeemers of the Lord praise him. Let those that have been redeemed from death, from sickness, from shame, from disappointment, lift up their voice before God of heaven and give that thanks to him and honor him from your heart. Just praise him. Praise him. Lift a voice in praise to him. Lift a voice in honor to him. Lift a voice in adoration to him. Lift a voice in adoration to God. Lift a voice in adoration to him. Worship him. Exalt him. Thank him. Let us glorify him. Let us bless the Lord. With all our soul, let's bless the Lord with everything that's in us. Let us give that thanks to Him, Jesus. This morning, I thank you. Jesus, this morning, I worship you. Jesus, this morning, I honor you. Jesus, this morning, I give you praise. Lift a voice and thank Him. Exalt Jesus. From the bottom of your heart, exalt him, exalt Jesus. We thank you for your love, O oh God. We thank you, Lord, for your love, O oh God. We thank you for your spirit, O oh God. We thank you for your grace in our life, in our home, in our family. We thank you. Somebody thank him. Let's show our love for the Lord. Let's show our love for the King, to the King of Kings, to the Lord of Lords, to the El Shaddai, to the one that is worthy to receive all glory. Let all glory be unto Him. Glory be unto God Almighty. Oh, thank the Lord. Thank Him. Worship Him. All glory be to Him. All honor be to Him. All adoration be unto the Lord. Let's thank Him. Give that thanks to Him. For waking you up this morning. For the Lord waking you up this morning. Let's appreciate Him. For waking you up this morning. Let's give glory to Him. For waking you up this morning. Let's appreciate Him. Lift a voice and bless the Lord. Glorify the King. Hallelujah. Jehovah God, we thank you. Jehovah God, we worship you. Jehovah God, we honor you. Jehovah God, we give that praise to you. Somebody give that praise to him. 
let your heart rejoice in him. We thank you, O God. We honor you, O God. We worship you, O God. We bless your name, O God. Bless the Lord, O my soul. Forget not all his benefit. Let's give that thanks to him. Lift a voice in honor. Lift a voice in adoration. Lift a voice in praise. Lift a voice in honor to God. God over God. God over God. We thank you. Somebody thank him. Lift a voice in honor to him. Appreciate him. Appreciate the Lord. Appreciate over God. Appreciate the King. Appreciate the Lord Almighty. Somebody thank him. Lift a voice and thank him. Lift a voice and honor him. Jehovah Shama, we thank you. Jehovah Nisi, we thank you. Jehovah El Shaddai, we thank you. We thank you for what you have done for us and for what you will do this morning. We thank you for your grace. We thank you for your love. We thank you for your spirit. We thank you for your love. We thank for your grace. We thank you for your love. We thank you for your grace. Just appreciate him. Give that glory to him. Give that honor to him. Praise him. From the bottom of your heart, praise him. From the bottom of your heart, praise him. Hallelujah. Somebody celebrate Jesus. Hallelujah. Somebody celebrate the King. Hallelujah. Somebody celebrate him. Thank you, Father. Thank you, El Shaddai. Thank you, Rose of Sharon. Thank you, our living God. In Jesus' name, we pray. The Bible says, in all things, we should give thanks to the Lord. He said, this is the will of God in Christ Jesus for us. He said, in all things, we should give thanks to God. He said, this is the will of God in Christ Jesus. He said, in all things, we should give thanks to God. I want us to give thanks to God this morning from your heart. I want us to give thanks to God from the bottom of your heart to Him. Let's thank Him for what the Lord has done for us, for what the Lord has done in our life. Let's celebrate Jesus. Let's honor Him. Let's give that thanks to Him. Let's give that glory to Him. Let's give that honor to the Lord. The Lord over God, we thank you. The Lord over God, we thank you. The Lord over God, we honor you. The Lord over God, we praise you. Just praise Him. Lift a voice. Bless Him. Appreciate Him. Give that honor to Him. To one that is due to receive it. All glory be unto God. All honor to the King. All praise to the Lord. All praise to Jehovah God. Thank Him. What a mighty God that we serve. What a mighty God that we worship. That heaven and earth bow before Him. Even the angels worship Him. Let's thank Him. We are serving the living God. Thank Him from your heart. Thank Him from your soul. Thank Him with everything that's in you. Let's thank Him. Let's honor Him. Give that praise to Him. Give that honor to Him. Thank Him. Thank the Lord for what He has done, for what He will do. Lift a voice. Bless the Lord. Lift a voice. Worship Jehovah God. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, El Shaddai. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Almighty God. Thank you, King of Kings. Thank you, our great God. Thank you, our living God. Thank you, my Father. Just thank Him. Thank you, Jesus. We are serving the Lord of miracles. Yes, 
and thank him. Worship him, give him praise. Exhort him, Father, we thank you, Lord Jesus. Exhort him, somebody lift a voice and just begin to bless the Lord. Worship him. Thank him. Thank the Lord, just thank Him, exhort Him, lift a voice and bless Him. Glorify His holy name, just thank Him, worship Him. Let's thank the Lord, let's begin to thank Him. Let's begin to glorify the King. Let's begin to glorify El Shaddai. Lift a voice from the bottom of your heart and give that praise to the owners of heaven and earth. Let's appreciate him. Give that honor to whom is due to receive it. Let's give that thanks to him. Jesus, we thank you. Jesus, we honor you. Jesus, we thank you. Just thank him. Appreciate him. Thank you, my Father. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. What about now? Is the volume getting better? Come on. Uh, is it getting better now or the volume is still the same? Is it okay? If you can hear me, just say you can hear me. What about now? It's better. Okay. This is the issue then. Okay. We've got this. Okay. I'm not the issue then. Okay. What, so it's getting better now. Okay. This is the issue. Okay. Hallelujah. So just, just thank him. Worship Him, give that thanks to Him. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Oh, Father, we thank you. Oh, we thank you, Lord Jesus. Praise the Lord. Always.
voice is true, the Lord is good to you. Lift your voice in praise and thank Him for what He has done. God is good. No matter the situation that you are in today, there's one area or another that the Lord God of heaven has been good to you. That's why we need to give thanks to Him at all times. That's why we need to worship Him. Because from one thing or other, God has been good to us. Let's lift our voice and just begin to appreciate Him. Lord, I thank you that you are good to me. Lord, I worship you. You are good. You are kind. Daddy, we thank you for your faithfulness over us. Thank Him for waking you up this morning to see another day is a privilege. To see another day is a privilege. Lift your voice and thank Him. Lift your voice and bless the Lord and glorify the King for it. Appreciate Him right now. Somebody thank Him. Lift your voice, bless the Lord. Bless the Lord, bless the King. Bless the over God. Thank Him, appreciate Him. Honor Him, give Him praise. Give the Lord that praise. Give the Lord that glory, honor unto His holy name. Righteous God, we thank you. Holy God, we honor you. Righteous King, we exalt you. For what you have done and for what you will do in our life, in our home. That's why we are here to say thank you, O God. That's why we are here to say, Lord, thank you for all that you have done for us and for all that you will do again in our life. We appreciate you. Thank you, good God. Thank you, righteous God. Thank you, Holy God of Israel. Thank you, El Shaddai. Lord, we bless your name. Lord, we glorify you. Blessed be the name of God. Blessed be the name of Jehovah. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. We thank you, O 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 God. I honor you, O God. I praise you, O God. We exhort you, O God. Thank you, Jesus, for all that you have done for us, for all that you will do. We thank you, Holy Spirit. Somebody exhort him. Somebody praise him. Somebody exhort the Lord. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Somebody thank you over God. My Lord and my Father, we thank you. My Lord and my God, I honor you. Somebody thank him. Give that praise unto him. Give that honor that belongs to him. He wants you to thank him. He demands it. He commands it. He wants it from you. So give it to him. Enter the gate with thanksgiving. No matter your situation. No matter what you are passing through, it's still being good to you. Oh, no matter what you want to say, God is still good to us. If we can think deeply, being alive, that you can hear me this morning, God is being good to you. Oh, and you know that when you have life, there is hope. When there is life, there is hope. Hallelujah. There is life, there is hope. So you have hope, no matter your situation, there is hope for you. There is hope for your life. It's only the dead. There is no hope for him on this earth. On this earth. Only the dead. There is no hope for the dead on this earth anymore. It can't function anymore on this earth. But there is hope for your life. Thank you, my Father. In Jesus' name, we pray the Lord know that if there is hope, he told Satan, don't touch his life. Do whatever you want to do for him. To him. Do whatever you want to do to him due to him, but his life sustain the life. And do you know that God himself never run in the heart of Satan to have the thought towards the wife of Job? Because God has a plan. No matter what you are passing through, there's a plan of God over your life. And the counsel of God will surely stand. The counsel of God 
will surely stand. The counsel of God will surely stand in your life. Lift your voice and thank you, Lord. See, I thank you because you care for me. No matter your situation, no matter my situation this morning, just open your heart and give that thanks to him. Lord, I thank you because you care for me. He cares for us. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. That's Satan. He wants us to feel in our heart that God don't really care. Do you think God cares about you? God don't really care about you. If God really cares about you, you will not go through what you are passing through right now. You will not be in that situation because he don't care. God don't care. He's about himself. Oh, just thank him. Lord, I thank you because you care for me. Thank you for your love that you pay the price for me. Thank you for giving your life to me. Thank him. He gave his life for us. Christ gave the life of him for us. Christ gave the life of him for us. Christ gave the life of him for us. Thank him for giving his life all for us. Thank you, Lord Jesus. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. Just begin to dip ourselves in the blood of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. My Lord and my God, I dip myself in the blood. In the blood of the Lamb. I want to begin to lift your voice and say, Lord, I dip myself in the blood of the Lamb, that the blood of Jesus cover me, O God. Open your heart to pray, my Lord and my God. I dip myself in the blood of Jesus. Let the blood of Jesus cover me. Somebody, let's begin to pray. I dip my life, I dip my dream, I dip my children in that blood that speak better things. I cover myself by the blood of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. Somebody pray. I cover myself in the blood of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. Pray. Somebody dip yourself in that lamb, in that in that blood of the lamb, in the blood of Jesus. I cover myself. Open your heart to God. Open your heart to him. Lift your voice to him. I dip myself in the blood of Jesus of Nazareth. Open your heart to him. I dip my life in the blood of Jesus. Somebody pray. Somebody dip yourself in the blood of the Lamb that the blood of Jesus should cover you. Open your heart to pray. Open your heart to pray. Lift your voice to him. In the name of Jesus. Mayaka tele masin telebo. Open your heart to him. Dip yourself in the blood of Jesus. Open your heart to God. Le patele ma ekapaya. Somebody dip yourself in the blood of Jesus of Nazareth. Somebody dip yourself in the blood of Jesus of Nazareth. Open your heart to him. My Lord and my God. Me takayaba. Lucin telebo. Somebody pray. In the name of Jesus, I dip my life in the blood. I dip myself in the blood. Somebody dip yourself in the blood of the Lamb. In the name of Jesus. Let's dip ourselves in that blood. That the blood of the Lamb to cover us. In the name of Jesus. Somebody pray. In the name of Jesus. Open your heart to God. Listen to Yabo. La prende seke labo. Somebody pray. Ika payaba. Le seka tayabo. In the name of Jesus. Manem te lebo sentelaba. Open your heart to pray. In the name of Jesus. E manem taye. That in the name of I dip myself. In the blood of Jesus. Oh, in the name of Jesus. Oh, masin tayaba. In taye. Somebody dip yourself in the blood. He said, if I can see that blood. Open your heart to pray. Oh, lick up if I can see the blood. Let the blood be seen over me this morning. Open your heart to pray. Let the blood be seen over me this morning. Somebody pray. Lift your voice. Manan Tayaba. Open your heart to God. In the name of Jesus. Somebody pray. In the name of Jesus. Open your heart to God. 
Somebody pray in the name of Jesus. Somebody pray and tell the Lord, if I can see the blood, let the blood be seen in me this morning. In the name of Jesus. Open your heart to God. Let the blood cover me. In the name of Jesus. Open your heart to him. That the blood of Jesus cover your life. Oh, my son, Tayabu. La prendo su to Kayaba. In the name of Jesus. Le prende kelebo. La pranda lava. In paruso tolega. Open your heart to God. In Jesus' name. Our Lord, we pray. The Bible told us in Leviticus chapter 17, verse 11. He said, For this life of a creature is in the blood. I've given it to you to make atonement for yourself on the altar and is the blood that make the atonement for one's life. Therefore I say to you, Israel, none of you may eat the blood. God is telling us, truly the Bible told us you can eat anything, not what you eat that comes, you know, that defy you. It's what comes out of your mouth. I don't eat this, you know, that don't defy you. Jesus said that. He said, what comes out of your heart is what that defiles you. But also, when you look at it, it's still helping you because he told us the life is in the blood. The life lives in the blood. That's why when you plead the blood of Jesus, not you are pleading that blood, you are pleading the life. You are pleading the life of Jesus Christ and through the life of him that we can be saved. We can only be saved but the life of God, life himself. So when you plead the blood of Jesus over yourself, it's not that the blood, the life of him, because the life of a man is in, in the very blood. So Christ shed his own blood, his life for you. Because the life is in that very blood. When you, that thing that makes you to walk today, those in the medical area, the blood that flows in your body, it determines everything about you. If there is no blood anymore, that person is gone. Right? In two minutes, that person is finished. Two minutes, one minute, that, if there is no blood anymore, they will earn anything. Everything functions through the blood. That's why Christ gave this life for us, for atonement for us. So when you plead the blood of Jesus, you are pleading the life of that, the Holy One of Israel. Without no sin. So an only thing that God can see is Him in your life. That's why if I can see that very blood, the blood of a lamb. You know, when God is doing the Passover, He told them to took a lamb without blemish. Is it typo of what to come? Is what to come? Is is of, of what to come? Christ that gave Himself for us. So when you plead the life. You plead the, life, the blood. You are pleading the life of Jesus over yourself. And that's the only one can be saved through that life of that man alone. He gave his life for me and you. So when Jesus died, and when that one of the, son, one of the Roman soldiers pierced him, pierced his body, the blood gushed out. And he's a dead man, you know. No, if someone is dead, there should not be blood anymore. Right? The blood dried up. But when they pierced him, you know, the blood came out of him. You see, truly, this is the child of God. Through that blood, oh my God, this is not, this is not ordinary man. Hallelujah. And he will share that life so that you may have life. He replace you. Oh, Christ, I'm a sinner. Is is no sin. He replaced every sin of mankind. The one to come, the one in the past, the one he, he set to it once of all. So, he pleased God of that punishment of the Lord Jesus Christ. When God, he pleased God for that punishment that Jesus took on the cross of Calvary. For me, and not for himself, for me and you, to them now that believe. I pray that the blood of Jesus cover you and wash away your sin. I was reading a scripture. The Bible, the Lord Jesus told that the, 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 the Pharisee and Sudacees, 
He told them that not because you are blind is a sin. Not because somebody is blind, that you are blind is not the sin, actual sin. He said because you pretend that you can see, but you are blind. You see that the way the sin lies. It's not the very sin. But the acknowledge of that very sin is what matters with God. He said, no, let me tell you, Jesus was telling them, not because you are blind is the issue. The issue is not that very sin. The issue that you pretend to know that you are not blind. I mean, when you don't agree that you are a sinner, that's the problem. Is it a sin? Yes, it's a sin. That's what God wants from every one of us. Agree with God and be at peace. He told them clearly, it's not the cause of that very thing that, that you are blind is the issue. He said to them, not because you are blind is the issue. But the issue is that you pretend that you can see. That means any time that you acknowledge that you are not a sinner. Oh, that's the main issue right there. That's the big problem with God. He said, when we acknowledge our sin, you know, when we act not perpetual sin that you are a sinner, they just quick live, keep on living the life of a sin. No, no, we do sin. That's why the general one say that we have no sin. If I can say this morning, I have no sin. That no, Bible told me I'm a liar. But if I acknowledge my sin before God and repent of it, it's faithful. The blood is available. He said, come, blow, come boldly to the throne of grace. We should come to him. Say, Daddy, I dip myself in the blood of you, O oh God. Let that blood cover me. Open your heart to pray that the blood of the Lamb to cover you. Yapaye katayaba. Open your heart to him that the blood of the Lamb in the name of Jesus cover me, O oh God. I dip myself in that blood of Jesus. I dip my life in the blood of Jesus. I dip myself in the blood of the Lamb. I cover myself in that blood. Open your heart to pray. Somebody pray. Open your heart to God. Somebody pray. Somebody pray that prayer. Open your heart to him. Lift your voice to Jesus. Dip yourself. Acknowledge my sin before you, God. Somebody acknowledge your sin. I am a sinner. Daddy, cover me in your blood. I am a sinner. I dip myself in the blood of the Lamb. Somebody dip yourself. In the blood of the Lamb, dip your shell in the blood of Jesus. Open your heart to God. Somebody dip your shell in the blood of Jesus. I dip my life in the blood. I dip myself. I acknowledge my sin. Let your favor, let your mercy cover me. Open your heart to pray. In the name of Jesus. Manantayabu. Le prendo si kayabum. Open your heart to God. Le para pate. Le son to le mae. Open your heart to God. Dip your shell in the blood of the Lamb. Dip your life in the blood of the Lamb. Dip your shell in the blood of the Lamb. Open your heart to pray. Somebody prayed. Dip yourself in it. In the blood of the Lamb. Acknowledge myself. Let the blood of Jesus wash away. Every sin, every iniquity of my heart, of my life, in the name of Jesus, I acknowledge myself, O oh God. I acknowledge myself. I acknowledge myself. In Jesus' name, we pray. Jesus told us clearly, clear statement. That's why I follow him. And that's why he's only one that I will believe. No matter all, all your, whatever, he's only one. He told us clearly in the scripture, in the word of God, in John chapter 11, he said, I give them eternal life. It's not, God, it's, it's not saying God will give them. He's not pointing to God. He's pointing to himself. 
I give them. I give them. He said, my sheep listen to my voice. I, I know them. He said, my very sheep listen to my voice and know the voice of him. So the sheep of God know the voice of God. I, 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 and then they follow me. So the sheep of God follow God. I give them eternal life. And they will never perish. So anyone, the sheep of God. And no one, look at the word in the scripture. You can circle that in your scripture, in your Bible. No one, even though not Satan himself. Not even Satan himself. No one, including Satan, can snatch them away from me. Not Satan himself can snatch those of his sheep, those of his sheep away from him. He will never, he will never agree. He will leave the 99 and run after that one. God will leave, Jesus will leave the 99. He will stay, but let's go and look for that one. That's why you will find favor. You will find favor before God. Among his sheep, Lord, we can't you worry. He said, No one, not Satan, he will not allow it. He said, No one, look at this. He said, My father has given them to me. So God give them, take this one, take, take, take this one. Hallelujah. Giving them to me is more powerful than anyone else. Is more powerful than anyone else. No one can snatch them. From the Father's hand, the Father and I are one. So what the Father is doing, also the Son can also do it. Jesus also can hold your life. He can keep you. As the Father can keep you, also the Son also can keep you. He said, no one will take them away from me. I pray you will find favor. Favor of salvation, no matter what, it can never perish. No matter what, God will not allow it. He will beat some people among the sheep. He will beat. You know, shepherd beat the, the shepherd beat the sheep too. That means he punish, he chastise, just to call your attention back. Say, so, no, listen, I will not let you go. Listen, even though yourself, you, you will not, you can't go. One Christ hold, take hold of you. You, you yourself, you can't release yourself. If you're trying to do that, he punish you. He slap you. He beats you. So you can't go nowhere. You can't go to hell. You can't. You will never go to hell. He will beat you. He will just try to 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 re, to re, to reprogram your brain that he is the Lord of our life. I pray we shall find grace, God's grace among his sheep. He will count you worthy. Among, he said, "My sheep know me. My sheep, so he knows." So your heart tells you, are you the sheep of God? Is your heart telling you that, am I saved? That's the question now. Or are you still looking at that? Ah, am I really this thing? If your heart is a part of his sheep, he will not let you go. He will not. But among the sheep, always acknowledge their sin and their ways before God. That they need help. That's why God, Jesus, told the Pharisee, if you pretend that, it's not that because you are blind, that's the main issue, but pretending that you are not blind. That's the main problem right there. He said the problem is pretending. That means if he's acknowledged that, oh, I need help, you will see the hand of God in your life. If you pretend, so acknowledging, not acknowledging our sin, that's the main, main issue. But if you acknowledge that you need help from God, that this is a sin, it's not good, this is not worthy of a child of God, God is ready to forgive those sins and cleanse us. He warned them. It's not because of that that you are blind, because you pretend you can see. You pretend that you can see. That is the issue. But he said, oh, I'm blind. That's what he's saying to them. I'm blind. I need help. Oh, God. You will see his hand in your life. I pray that the hand of God will rest on you. Say that amen. Say, Lord, as I come to you, have mercy on me. As I come to you, Lord, have mercy upon my life. Let's begin to pray. 
the Lord, as I come to you, in the name of Jesus, have mercy on me. Somebody begin to pray, the Lord God of heaven, to show mercy. Inayama asa toyaba, lukunta liparisate, open your heart to God. Maya kuto kurapate, likando yama isha kayaba, luprendo shikelebo, open your heart to God. Liprendo shuntu kupalikate, somebody pray, lipanta yaba. Somebody pray, ikateli mashika yaba. Lord, have mercy on me. Somebody pray for the mercy of God. In your life right now, open your heart to pray. In the name of Jesus. Pray for the mercy of God this morning. In the name of Jesus. Pray for the mercy of God this morning. In the name of Jesus. Pray for the mercy of God this morning. Over your life. Ikatayaba yaba. Open your heart to him. Leprendo shika yaba. Open your heart to God. Lord, have mercy upon my life. Lord, have mercy upon my children. Lord, have mercy upon my family. Open your heart to him. Lord, have mercy upon me right now. Somebody pray in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to him in the name of Jesus. Lord, have mercy on me. Somebody pray for God's mercy over your life. Let's pray the Lord God of heaven, to show that mercy in the name of Jesus. Somebody pray, la paix yakata, have mercy on me, in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to him. Yekata yaba. Somebody pray, le porosa telebo. Somebody pray, the Lord should have mercy upon your prayers, have mercy upon my life. Pray that prayer, lift your voice to God, my Lord and my God. Have mercy on me, in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to God. E pare patayabo. In the yam patelebo. Le prendo shikayabo. Le prende sikelebo. Open your heart to God. Rapate le masetelebo. Open your heart to him. E katala baye. La pranda le pali. Open your heart to him. Have mercy on me. In the name of Jesus. Have mercy on me. In the name of Jesus. Have mercy on me. Somebody pray. The Lord should have mercy upon your life. The Lord should have mercy upon your home. The Lord should have mercy upon your children. The Lord should have mercy upon my life this morning. In Jesus' name, we pray. That is set to my case, O God. Somebody pray that the Lord Jehovah God set to my case. Set to my life, O God. Let's begin to lift our voice and pray in the name of Jesus. Let's begin to pray. The Lord God of heaven. To set to your case this morning. My Lord and my God. Open your heart to God. Let's begin to cry to God. Say Lord God of heaven. Set to my case O God. In the name of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. Let's begin to pray. The Lord Jehovah God to set to your case. In the name of Jesus. Somebody pray that prayer. My Lord and my King. Set to my case O God. In the name of Jesus. Lord set to my case O God. In the name of Jesus. Open your heart to God. My Lord and my God. Let God of, God of heaven set to your very case in the name of Jesus. Somebody pray in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to God. Daddy, in the name of Jesus, let my case be set to. In the name of Jesus, let my life be set to. In the name of Jesus, somebody pray that prayer. Open your heart to him. The Lord God of heaven to set to your case in the name of Jesus. Somebody cry to God. The Lord God of heaven set to my case in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. Let's cry before the Lord, the Lord God of heaven. Somebody pray that prayer. Jehovah God, let my case be set to. In the name of Jesus, let my lie be set to. In the name of Jesus, let my need be set to. Somebody pray. Set to my case, O God. In the name of Jesus, somebody cry before the Lord, the Lord God of heaven, to set your case in the name of Jesus. Mayatayaba. Father, in the name that is above every other name, Jehovah God, let their case be settled. In the name of Jesus, set to my case. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name, we pray. Say, Lord, bring an end to it to this morning, my battle. Open your heart to pray. Tell the Lord to bring an end to every battle of your life, to every battle of your dream. Open your heart to pray. In the name that is above every other name, my Father, 
in Jesus' name. La paya kayaba. Daddy, in the name of Jesus, bring an end to my battle. Open your heart to pray to every battle of Malahai. Let it come to an end. To every struggle, let it come to an end. Ayayayaba. Somebody pray. Let the battle. Eka paya mayokata. Le zonto le mele. Le prendo shike yabo. Daddy, in the name that is above every other name. Somebody pray that prayer. Somebody open your heart to God. The Lord should bring to an end the battle of your life, the battle of your dream. Mayata yapa, la pando yekata. Somebody pray, open your heart to God. Jesus, let my battle come to an end. Jesus, let my battle come to an end. Jesus, let my shame come to an end. Somebody pray, the Lord God of heaven to bring to an end the battle of your dream. Ya 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 babo sata la prando shika yabo. Somebody pray that prayer. The Lord God of heaven bring my battle, bring my struggle, bring my shame to an end, O oh God. Bring my failure to an end, O oh God. Bring my disappointment to an end, O oh God. Open your heart to pray, my Lord and my God. I am an antaya lembrando shika yabo. Somebody pray in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to God. Mayaka Payaba, open your heart to God. Le prendo shikabo. Somebody pray in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Open your heart to God. Daddy, bring my battle to an end. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Say, Lord, whatever thing that take hold of me, that's why God must settle some battles in your life. Because there are some battles in our life that not allow your moving forward. Certain things that you are passing through never allow you to take the next step until this one is settled. There are many things that you are in today that don't allow you to take the next step. If you are believing God for a child and you are not married, so how that is going to happen? The certain thing God has to set to for you to take the next step. I can, I can you have money to do things where you don't you are trusting God for a job, or how can you, you know, uh, you know, say I want to go to to your country, when you don't have a papers to go, or how can you say, oh, God has established, God wants to let you go to other other state, other country, when you don't have a visa, it's not possible, and the grace of God is among you to to go, an enemy is holding you, delaying your passport, so certain things has to be settled. Hallelujah. How can you have owner of a company? I want to be on my own. I want to have this career. When devil don't allow you to pass the board exam, I can you no no enter into your full career when the board exam is still an hindrance and obstacle. I can you enjoy your marriage? Now if the sticing. Hallelujah. Or oh, the other side too. It can be it can be both. It can be Tyson and also it can be Jesse Bell. It can be <laughs> it can be both. Hallelujah. Or oh, devil is walking around. So I can you enjoy it. So that's why you pray. That is set to my battles. Set to it. So you can move forward. Until Pharaoh was removed. The children of Israel did not allow them to go. Until Pharaoh was removed. Set to my battles, oh God. Somebody pray. In the name of Jesus, open your heart to pray. Pray for your children that must settle their battles. Their battles over their life. I am Ayelia. Le porosa teaba. Le prendo sin telebo. Somebody pray, 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 pray. Mayande yeboko payaba. Manem prende sin telebo. Mando prende sin telebo. Mande prende kapayaba. Somebody pray the Lord God of heaven to set your battle. Ikare makapayaba. Manem prendo sin telebo. Manem prende sin telebo. Maye kataya bayaba. Mato kurabagaba. Masin ke telebo. Open your heart to pray. Maten ke lebo. Manem kapayabo. Somebody pray. Manem tele makata. Open your heart to God. Eka telebo. Le prende sin telebo. Somebody pray. Open your heart to him. Somebody cry to the Lord. The Lord God of heaven. Jehovah. Jehovah God. Said to my battles. 
In the name of Jesus, send you that battle of that delay. Is that delay that is bad? Send you that battle of that sickness. Is that sickness in your body? Open your heart to pray. Is that failure in your life? Tell the Lord, my Father, I cry to you. Set to my battle, so God. In the name of Jesus, somebody pray. In Nayaya, Makuta Yaya, Leposo Toke Lebo, Mako Prandaka, Le Sonto Le Mekete, Maye Porosate, Le Prendo Sike Lebo, La Prendo Sike Lebo. Somebody pray. In the name of Jesus, open your heart to God. In Nayaba, Ekelima, Sotoli Mekete, open your heart to God. Le Kandayaba, La Pendo Lime, Le Prendo Sinte Lebo. In Jesus' name, we pray. The man, the man in the scripture, he said to the Pharisee, he said, how, who told you? How do you get ill? They asked that very man, how do you get ill? How do you get ill? He said, I don't know. There is a man called Jesus Christ took a clay and put it in my eyes. A clay. What Jesus Christ is demonstrating is demonstrating to all that the one is the one that made man. He picked up a clay, a mud, and put in his face and told him, Go. The word in Hebrew sent. He sent him, Go and wash your face. And the man washed his face and he was ill. And the Pharisee and the Sudasee have issue with it. Your miracle will manifest. Those that have issue with your miracle, God will shame them. Say that, Amen. They know some people have issue with your moving forward. Some people have issue with your going higher. They have issue with it. I, I, I just want that sister not to marry. Why? I, just, I, don't, I, don't, I don't feel like it. I don't want to, that sister to have a child. They have issue with your success. So the Pharisee, not only that, they're trying to do the things of God, but they have issue with be, that boy. Be, the eyes was open. Jesus Say, go and wash your face. And he deep he washed the face and he received his sight. He received his sight. If you look at John chapter 9, and Jesus walking along, he saw a man who has been blind from his bath. And Rabbi, his disciple asked him, who sin? You see, no one. And Jesus healed him. He says, go and wash yourself in that pool. And people begin to have issue. See, daddy, those that have issue, you know, I'm not saying you've been thinking about sister so so so. She has asked me a question before. I think she has issue. I'm not saying when you pray, let your heart be open. Don't think of anyone. Especially you are praying, let them die by fire. Don't think, God is not going to kill anyone that you have in thought that you should die. Because he paid the price for him too. As he paid the price for your life. You can just tell him to deliver you. He knows what to do. You don't tell God, let this person die. God will not answer you such a prayer. He told you what to do. It's scripture. When you see enemy, pray for them. Ah, pastor, is you are the one that wants to say that. Is you, is you. No, no, oh, ah, the old is, is the scripture, not me. Is the, is the word of God. The word of God is more than any revelations. It's not me. The word of God, so that you pray for your enemy. Ah, I can't pray for them. Ah, let them. I'm not saying they will not die. They will die. But you don't demand this from God. That that's the main issue of your life. That this is so 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 at my place of work. Ah, blood in the name of Jesus. Let this sister, let this brother. Ah, die, die. God, you will stay for so long. That's why many of us we are going through battle for so long, because God will not ever listen to such a prayer. Telling you somebody should die in your heart. You are thinking, you're waking up. He paid the price for you. You yourself, you are a sinner. Him also walking in the sin, in that sinful way. He paid the price for both. So it takes time for God to take action on that. So God just look at just I want the person to die. Let the person die. Let the children perish. I'm not saying God is not going to answer. He will answer. He will punish them. He will do, but not on your own. He told you to pray for them. That's why sometimes God don't show us our enemies, the one behind your case. That's why God don't show you. Because right away, many of us, we can't undo it. You begin to have animosity 
against the person. You see the person. Ah, this person finish. And God don't want you to have such a spirit in you. That's why God don't reveal many things to us because we can't undo it. You can't undo it. You can't undo it. So people have issue with that very boy. God said, go and wash yourself. And the boy said one clear statement to the Pharisee. He said, have you ever seen anyone that opened his eyes before? And truly, tell me in the scripture, from Genesis to Revelation, before Jesus Christ, before, no, from Genesis to Malachi, anyone opened the eyes of any blind man? No, not even Moses. Not even Moses. He's only, the man said, that, have you ever seen before that somebody's eyes, and that's what the Bible told us that Messiah is going to do when Messiah show up. So this person must be a Messiah because that's what the Bible told us in the book of Isaiah that is going to give sight to the blind. So that means this must be the Messiah. This must be the main person that we take away. Today, anyone ganging against your glory Anyone that have volunteer for to pull your life down for your failure to continue today, God will put an end to them. Say the kapaya yaba, he kapaye. Somebody open your heart to pray. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, shame them with my miracle, shame them with my fulfillment, shame them with my moving forward. Can somebody open your heart to pray? In Yabaka Sayabo, Lemprendo Shin Telebo, Lamprendo Copalicata, Lemprendo Shin Telebo Caban, somebody pray, pray, pray. In the Yaba Yeboso de Ropocotica Yaba, shame my enemy with my miracle, God, shame them with my joy, O God, in the name of Jesus. In Yaba Yepate, Luprendo Sikayaba, somebody pray. Those that have vow in their darkness, those that have vow over my children. Those that have vowed in the name of Jesus. Those that have vowed not in this life that I will move forward. Those that have vowed not in this life that I'm going to go higher. Those that have vowed, listen to your Open your heart to pray. That Lord God of heaven to shame them. Every power of darkness over me. Every evil confession over everyone this morning. Every struggle, every shame, every disappointment. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, good. God, in Jesus' name, let my miracle happen. The miracle happen, whether the enemy like it or not. Let my joy happen to me. I want to. The joy of that very man happened to them. In that John chapter 9, verse 41, that's why I said earlier on that Jesus told the Pharisee, you are just an hindrance to people. If you are blind, you will not be guilty. You could not be guilty. That's what Jesus was saying to them. If you are blind, not the blindness is issue. Look at Jesus' reply. But if you remain guilty, you remain guilty because you claim that you can see. It's not the blindness is the issue. That you are claiming that you can see. That's the problem. You are claiming that you have no sin. That is the issue. Jesus told us in that John chapter 9, verse 41, if you are blind, you could not be guilty. But he replied, but you remain guilty because you claim you don't need the salvation. We remain guilty when we claim that we don't need the help of God. Every power, he kapayala, standing against your life, be judgment over you. Say, no, you will not come out of that issue in life. The Lord will put them to shame. Open your heart and pray. My miracle. Open your heart to God. Upon today, in the name of Jesus, can we lift our voice and begin to pray? Tell the Lord. The Bible told us in Isaiah chapter 46 verse 10, declaring the end from the beginning, from the ancient time, that things are not yet done, saying, my cancer shall stand, I will do all that plea, all my pleasure, may come that 
calling the raven bell from the east, a man that executes my cancer from far country, yea, I spoke it, and also I will bring it to pass, I will propose it, and I will do it. All God's plan over your life this year must come to pass. What God's purpose over your life this year doors open, doors open, doors open, doors open in Jesus' name. We pray, speak to the atmosphere. Any power that don't want the atmosphere to be favorable to you, the Lord will put them to shame today. Every, every spirit around your life that don't want the atmosphere that you are in to be favorable to you, only spirit of God will put them to shame. As on today you walk in God's grace, I speak to the atmosphere around me. I speak to the atmosphere around my life. I speak to the atmosphere around my children. I speak to the atmosphere in this city. I speak to the atmosphere. If God open your eyes and see what is the atmosphere, whether you pray more or you run. I speak to the atmosphere around me. Elia, my opa, ya. Lozonto ye meketia. Lograndu kapela gaba. Yeka yika ye. Imba opa rusata. Nika pelipe. Atmosphere around you begin to favor you. Ika payaba. Atmosphere around you begin to bring blessing to you. Atmosphere around you in the name of Jesus. Let heaven open. Ay, 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 ay. Le sondo yaba. Lo prondo shikelebo. Atmosphere around you. Favor of God. Favor of God. Favor of God in the atmosphere around your life. Thank you, our righteous one. Thank you, good God. Thank you, El Shaddai. In Jesus' name. Our Lord, we pray, Amen. The Lord will complete it for you. See that, Amen. See that, Amen. The Lord God of heaven will complete it for you. See that, Amen. He will complete it. He said, "You perfect things that concern me." The Lord will complete it for you. In the name of Jesus, the Lord God of heaven will complete it. The Lord will perfect it. All what you have been waiting for, all what you have been seeking, the face of Him, He will complete it. God did not work. The, the economy or the system never determine God's miracle. What determines God's miracle is from above. May you receive all what you need. May, may that very blessing be delivered to you. No more deny. No more deny. Thank you, righteous God. In Jesus' name, we pray. The atmosphere around you begin to favor you. The atmosphere around you begin to favor you. Any atmosphere that is harsh to your life, let Holy Spirit remove you from it and put it in the atmosphere that will favor you. May you walk into your blessing, your glory. So shall it be. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. Amen. Your miracle will come. Your miracle will come. In the name of Jesus. You have been waiting for it. Your miracle will come. You have been waiting to see it. Your miracle will come. And let the name of Jehovah God be glorified. Thank you, righteous one. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. Amen. Can I hear that amen louder? Ask God for what you need this morning. Tell him by yourself. 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 Him by yourself. Ask him to do it. And let the name of Jehovah God be glorified. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. Amen. Receive it. Receive it. Doors open for it in Jesus' name. We pray, amen. Praise the Lord. We just put in mind that the prayer continued tonight by God's grace at the same time at midnight by God's grace. And also, um, our program next week from next week, Saturday, not this week, next week, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday in London. And all, I told us what we're going to do write your request, put it in the envelope, put your name because. We're going to put it in one place and we'll pray over it. And I'm going to give it back to you. Praise the Lord. So you write your request. We're going to put it in one place, every one of us. And uh, we're going to pray over it. And I will give it to you. You know, we'll, we'll take it by your name. So you have to know. So you take that very thing. Don't worry. Let's leave the rest for God. What God is going to do, I don't know. But uh, I just believe. Is the owner of the work. He will do whatever you want to do. But I know that he's going to meet you at the point of your need when your heart opens. So 
by God's grace, you know, I've been saying I'll put that there, I'll put that there. Betting, the, if you need the program, if you're in London, just let me know. I'll send the flyer to you. Even though I should have been posting the flyer here, did I post the flyer on the Facebook? Hmm. I think I need to do that too, just to post it out there, you know, just to know. I will do that. So you can get it from there. And I think I need to do that by God's grace. Um, and also, by, by as a second week, you know, maybe if you are in Ireland, like Ireland area around that, so maybe maybe a second week I'll probably be in London, in Ireland also in the second week. I'll probably be in Ireland in the second week. And uh, and also France, by God's grace, we are still working on that. By God's grace, maybe the third week, the third week, I'll probably be in it. And what else again? And also, we are still working on Chicago. So, if you are in Chicago, by God's grace, it's just for those people to get the. It's, I told you, it's not like I know any place, you know. So, I'm working with you people. So, I have to, because I don't know anywhere. You are the one that just tell me this is what it is and let us know. So, we work by it. And also, anywhere in Nigeria in September, by God's grace, and I told you, anywhere. When God said go, I will go. Anywhere, you know, that's the duty of this ministry is to go out there, go out there, preach the gospel. And I know the Lord Jehovah God that I have his plan from the beginning, before I know anything, that he wants to set his people free from his bondage, from bondage. He will do it. That's the purpose of God. He is the one that wants to set people that you see, people are in bondage. You see, he wants to set them free. Not me. I can't set anybody free. Even though I myself, I need freedom. But it's the one that wants to set people free. That told me, I want to set my people free. So I know if we do what he said that he will do. Okay, we do, we do what you said that you will do. That's what I believe. Hallelujah. Is what I said. It. So I have nothing to do with it. Me just go. Me sit down. Me start, start. That's my duty. He's the one that wants to do it. And I know he's going to do it in your life. In Jesus' name. Let's go. Father, we thank you for this water, O oh God. Let this water be blessed. Release your grace upon this water. In the name of Jesus. Father, we cover this water by your blood. To everyone trust you for the fruit of the womb. Father, grant unto them. No more delay, no more deny. What you have given to them, let it manifest, O oh God. Show yourself strong. And let your name alone be glorified. In Jesus' name. Our King will pray. Amen. Let's share the grace together. The grace of Jesus Christ, the love of God, and His perfect Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life. We shall join us the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Can somebody shout a big hallelujah? Can we shout a big hallelujah? You are blessed and highly favored. Thank you for being here. God bless you. See you later on in the evening. God bless you. Bye bye.